again, this is Father Clay Kimbrough, and we just wanted to let you know that all of us are praying here at St. Anne for, for your health and your safety and your comfort, especially at this time uh, during these difficult days. And so we made a video of all different parishioners um, saying that they're praying for you from all across our parish uh, to wherever you are right now. God bless you and keep you. Take care. We're ready? Hi, Father Kent. It's Pat Ciotti. Hello, Just wanted so to wonderful. say we're thinking about you a lot, and I remember the good days when we yes. worked together uh, so very well with uh, RCIA and, and Joanna and transformed this parish into a really great place. And uh, I thank you for that. And I just you wish you comfort, peace, joy and good days and take care hi father kent this is carl and melanie witty many memories were shared with you at saint anne's our thoughts and prayers are with you father kent this is mary todd coloni uh, i offer you all my prayers and love we hope that you are feeling some relief and that God will take you into his loving arms and take care of you soon. Uh, we love you, we miss you. Love and prayers, Mary, Todd, and family. Hi, Father Kent, it's Chuck and Janet Marshall. We just want you to know how much we are praying for you um, and what an influence you were in our spirituality. God bless you. Thanks, Father. Bill and Dina Walker. We're always we're praying for you that Jesus will hold you close to his heart, give you strength and peace in this terrible time in your lives for you and your family. Father Kent, my name is Mary Clarkin. I'm the daughter of Margaret and Emma Clarkin. And you celebrated the Mass at my father's funeral, so thank you. And you're in my prayers. And I find it an inspiration how you've accepted uh, the news about your health. May God bless you. Thank you. Hi, Father Hamburger. This is Karen and Jim Urban. And we just wanted to let you know that you're in our thoughts and prayers. Father Kent, this is Carol Ann Sean. You married Randy and I in 2003. We will be married this year, 17 years. We miss you, God bless you, and we pray for you daily. God bless. Good morning, Father Kent, it's Joanne Cooper. I want to kind of go over our time together in your life. Uh, I want to thank you, first of all, for all the energy, effort, and joy that you put into St. Anne's for all those years. Uh, there's no way to really thank you for that, but just I want you to know that I know and I noticed and I appreciate all that you did. Um, from the time you were a newbie priest at the cathedral, and I used to go to daily mass there, that's where I first got to know you, and then we were uh, available together to work Crucio teams, and I enjoyed you there uh, through the years, and then I got to really know you at St. Anne's after that, and especially while Molly and Shannon were in school at St. Anne's, uh, it was such a joyful time for me to have them in Mass with me and to watch them grow uh, in the light of a Catholic education and with all your energy and effort that you encourage that. I thank you for all the good memories. I thank you for all the energy. I thank you for all the hard work. I want you to know that I journey with you during this time of yours. I pray for you often and constantly think about you. And I want you to know how excited I am because I know the joy that you feel and the excitement that you feel for the next stage of your life. Thinking about you, hoping that daily you are not in pain and praying for the love you have for God. Thank you, Father. Hi, Father Kent. This is Sam and Judy Darnell. We were blessed to be members of St. Anne's Parish during your entire time that you were pastor here. I'll always remember your friendly smile. You married our youngest daughter, Stacy, and baptized her two daughters. I don't know whether you remember it or not, but we share the same birthday, and I'll always think of you on March 3rd every year. We were saddened to hear of your diagnosis of cancer. We do pray for you daily. 
And old Father Kent, this is Terry. And Robin Mapes. You baptized me back in 1997, and I thought I'd let you know that you're in our thoughts. And in our prayers. And we wanted to thank you for all that you did for St. Anne's when you were here. And we really learned a lot of life lessons uh, with the renovation uh, that you did a wonderful job with. I know you had a big job uh, to do with that. But we just wanted to let you know that we're thinking about you. God bless you. This is Katie. Hi, my name's Audrey. Thomas. Abby. Thank, thank you, you for, for baptizing, baptizing us. us. Thank you for baptizing us. We're praying for you. We're, we're praying for you. We're praying for you. We're praying for you. Hi, Father Kent. This is Janet and Bill Getz. And we just wanted to thank you for your time and dedication you gave to St. Anne's. We also would like to thank you for giving the sacraments to both our daughters, Nicole and Megan. We are We're praying, praying for, for you. you. This is Nathan Carpenter. We met at an MPM event luncheon in January, and you taught me about the history of St. Anne's School. I'm praying for you. Hi, Father Kent. This is Terry Bayo. And I just wanted to let you know that we're thinking of you and praying for you. We are parishioners at St. Anne's Church, and um, you were the priest there when we first moved here from California, and you helped us a lot with our family and, and all that, and we really appreciate everything you did for us. We've considered you a priest for the people. You've always done everything for the people, and you've always your parishioners have always been your number one priority, and we appreciate everything you've done for us over the years. We're thinking of you and praying for you. Hi, Father Kent. This is Lloyd and Sheila Henning, uh, longtime members of uh, St. Anne's Parish, and we're still there. A little grayer, a little more wrinkles, but uh, we're still there. Just wanted to uh, let you know our thoughts and prayers are with you and uh, what you're going through. So, uh, we had four daughters that uh, went through school there, and uh, uh, their names are... Amy and Jennifer, and the twins were Heidi and Heather. Uh, Amy taught at St. Anne's second grade and just retired after 18 years. And Jennifer is teaching preschool at St. Anne's and she's been there for 15 years. Heidi also teaches, she teaches out in California. So St. Anne's made a good impression on our girls. And a lot of that was due to your efforts and keeping the school together and all of that. Got just one quick photo of uh, you and I and the state officers for the Knights of Columbus. Hopefully you can see that without the glare, but you're in the center there. You, If you remember, you helped us start the council there, and for that we're very appreciative. That was a long time ago. So, Again, uh, we'll remember you in our prayers and wish you the very best. And we'll Thank be praying you. for you every day, Father. Thank you for all you've done. Bye-bye. Bye. Hi, Father Kent. This is Jacqueline Johnston. Um, you've been a big part of my family's life, the Slusser family, the Pedigo families, since my first communion in second grade, so 30 years ago at St. Anne's. Also baptized both of my nephews at St. Vincent de Paul, married my brother and sister at St. Anne's. Um, we really... Love you and appreciate you, and you continue to be in our prayers. Thank you. Father Kent, this is the Slusser family, Galen, Juanita, Rita, and Renee. All of us that you helped with Saint, at St. Anne's in, over the years, we really enjoyed it. And uh, we're praying for you and hope that you're doing well. So uh, anyway, Hang in there, and we'll maybe see you later. Bye. Juanita, you got something to say? <laughs> Renee was next. Oh, okay. <laughs> She's last. <laughs> uh, thanks for being a great leader and a role model for our family while I was growing up. Thank you, Father Ken. Um, Rita Pettigo is my name now, and you gave many sacraments to my children, Jamie and Jacqueline, Jason Pettigo, and Jason's wife, Jessica, along with their kids, Jackson and JC. You'd give her first communion last year and Jackson's baptism. And then, and Mason's 
uh, Jamie and Tyler Miranda and their son Mason, you baptized them, uh, and uh, Jacqueline and Eric Johnston. Um, you had a big impact in their lives with sacraments along their way in school, and we thank you very much. We've got pictures of them back here. So they also wish you best wishes, and, and we're praying for you every day, and we know that God will bless you and take you right to heaven. Take care. We've enjoyed having you as our friend, too. And you're in our prayers. God bless you. Bye. Miss you. Hi, Father Kit. It's Jessica Pedigo. JC Pedigo. I'm Jackson Pedigo. We just want to thank you so much for all you've done for us. You married Jason and I over at St. Anne's in 2007, and you actually baptized me. And thank you so much for um, being our priest at, in Andover and for giving my first communion. Thank you for baptizing me at Andover. We're thinking of you and we're praying for you and we hope you feel better. Bye, Bye. Father Kent. Bye, Father Kent. Hi, Father Kent. It's Bill and Sandy Cole. I used to be a Humlachek. Roman and Alice are my mom and dad. And dad died five years ago. And mom is in assisted living memory care now. Um, we just wanted to send you our love and prayers and uh, wish you the best. You actually married us at the cathedral in November of 2001. So it worked. Yay. Yep, still happily married. <laughs> yes. So thank you very much. We're sending our love and prayers your way and um, wish you the best. Hi, Father Kent. Hi, it's Father Kent. Jamie Pedigo, Miranda. Tyler Miranda. <laughs> Here, um, you were there for my first confession, my first communion at St. Anne's, uh, confirmation. You did my first communion. Um, you came in and talked to us at school at St. Anne's, and you uh, you baptized our son. He's now a year and a half old, and we're so blessed to have you be such a big part of our lives. Um, we're thinking about you. We're praying for you. Best wishes, and we truly love you. Love you. Bye. Bye. Hey, Father, this is Maria, and I just wanted to give you, tell you thank you for giving me the opportunity to be part of St. Anne's, and also that, to let you know that you are in my prayers every day. And I'm thinking about you, and I hope you're not in a lot of pain, and that we're always praying for you. Thank you, Father, and take care of yourself. Father Kent, uh, so on behalf of the people of St. Anne, I want to say thank you for the, the time, the service that you, uh, that you did here, um, preparing this, uh, this wonderful parish and uh, this place. Um, personally, I want to thank you for, uh, for the help that you gave me as I started out as pastor here. Uh, thank you very much. Know that you're in our prayers. Uh, the people here still uh, love you and uh, pray for you very much. God bless.